Today I'm going to teach you one simple way to reduce your costs and increase your revenues. So on my menu boards, I used to have a lot of menu items. I used to think that the more options, the more choices on my menu that I would have for my customer, the more my customer would be interested, the more they would come and spend with me. I could not have been more wrong. I thought more is better, it will attract them, I can sell more. I could not be more wrong. Less is more, is what I learned. The less you have, the better you'll do. So on my menu board, instead of having too many different things, I realized that only 30 to 40% of my menu is actually selling. So let me cut down what's not selling, keep a few items here and there to attract a customer, but the most, that, all that go well with the dish, but the 30 to 40% is really what is selling, just let me keep that. Once I overcame the fear that it's okay that less is more, and I don't need to have a lot on my menu to attract customers, I began to see that I made decisions for the customers much easier. When I looked at it, I also saw that now that I have a smaller menu, I have less cost of inventory of food and beverage. I have less things to worry about in terms of quality. My labor was had more time to focus on less number of items on my menu, so they had more time to upsell. There were so many benefits to having less than having more. And then when I learned that, okay, this is working on my menu and I'm actually looking at that my costs are going down because of course, even my food costs dropped, right? Wastage dropped is where the food costs dropped. Wastage dropped because I didn't have too many things on my menu. And when I realized the benefits of less is more, I said, where else in my company can I use this philosophy of less is more? And I looked at my messaging and it's like, what am I telling the customer out there? I'm trying to tell them I'm this and I'm trying to tell them I'm that. I'm trying to tell them I sell this. They only have one second of that split second decision when they're hungry. Am I coming in that decision? Am I coming in that second? So I started working on my messaging of what is my customer understanding of who I am? How do I stand out from my competition when he's hungry? How does my name come up and how does he decide or she decide to want to spend money with me? So I simplified my messaging. And then I looked at the processes that we have in the restaurant and I said, which processes am I doing that are redundant, that are not of use anymore, that are just wasting my employees' times. And I started simplifying. And it's when I simplified things, I made things easier. Even for me, when I simplified things, they became easier. I could focus on exactly the areas that actually made money. I could focus on processes or systems or dealing with my employees or training or wherever part of my business that actually brought out more in outcome. When you simplify things, you amplify the outcome, you amplify the revenues, you make it easier for everyone. So if you simplify your menu, if you simplify your messaging, if you simplify your processes, all you're doing is making it easier for your customer to take that split second decision when it matters the most, when they're ready to eat and spend money, the money should come to you. But you gotta simplify things for that. So what is it that you can do right now to simplify your operations, to simplify your menu, to simplify your messaging? Look around you, where is it on your menu that is unnecessary, cut it off. Where is it in your processes that nobody cares about? Cut it off. Where is it that you're spending your time and energy that's really not making a difference to your revenues? Cut it off. Don't do more. Everybody looks at what should I do to increase revenues? Don't do more. Do less. Less is more. You need to be able to give your customer a menu that makes his life simpler to order more with you. You need to have messaging that strikes the mind of the customer in that split second when he or she is hungry and willing to spend. They need to remember you. And you need to have processes and systems that are simple that your employees can spend more time on to deliver better quality. To increase your revenues and cut your costs down, you need to simplify things. That's that one simple way. Try it right now. Comment below, leave some comments. I'd love to hear from you. Email me, ask me questions, share your problems about your business. Tell me what you want me to talk about. Let's have a conversation. Have a great week. See ya.